Lately, I've been checking out a lot of cloud storage services, but none of them offers a perfect solution for teams or businesses. Google Drive and Dropbox are good for personal use, but are not so great for teams and businesses because of limited storage, high cost, and not so great privacy protection. So I'm not even gonna consider those. But there is one service I found that is very promising for my team, that is Sync.com. Hey, what's up? My name is Shivam and before getting to the video if you want to get a significant discount on sync.com then you can head to the first link in the description or go to sync.com slash the inventor for businesses there are a couple of things that are must have for us what we need is an ample amount of storage with easy to use sharing and collaboration feature low pricing good privacy and administrative control also integration with microsoft office is necessary to save our precious time right now let's talk a little bit about about privacy first. Companies like Google and Dropbox have bad track record when it comes to protecting your privacy. As a business, we need to choose companies that do not track us and keep our data safe. This is non-negotiable. Let's look at Sync. Sync has a great track record when it comes to data privacy because they have strong encryption and better access controls. That means all of the files stored in the cloud are protected from unauthorized access. I've checked and they also state that they comply with GDPR, PIPEDA and even HIPAA. All this makes it quite trustworthy for businesses that are storing sensitive data like healthcare companies or educators or even content creators working with confidential client data. This is definitely better than Dropbox or Google. Moving on, let's see what other features they offer. When we work professionally in Teams, it's obvious that files must be online but be editable simultaneously. So to help us with that, there is a feature in Sync that allows us to integrate our cloud storage to Microsoft Office, to its desktop, mobile and web application. Upon installing the app on a desktop, we get a folder that works exactly like your regular folder but this folder is linked to to your cloud account so it will keep your files updated with your cloud storage we can also use the android ios and web interface to access our files from anywhere we also have the cloud files feature with which you can access your cloud files without taking any storage space locally keep in mind this is still in beta but it's an awesome feature talking about the file sharing options we can create a common folder that team members can access and collaborate and if you want to share a file externally you can also do that plus you can control how you want to share files or folders like you can disable downloads set expiry etc last but not least we get administrator tools that can help us organize users that looks like a super amazing package. To protect from data loss, Sync also has a couple of features that can save our life, like account rewind. In case of ransomware or hardware failure, this option can help you rewind your account. If you accidentally delete or modify a file, you can access previous versions and restore that file without having those versions taking space in your cloud storage. After talking about all this, it's time for speeds. While syncing my files and folders, I found the speeds were fine. Not the fastest I've experienced, but not that bad either. But I guess we generally don't have humongous single files in professional environment, rather small but numerous files, which it serves very well. Now let's talk about Sync's pricing. For businesses with multiple team members or employees, you simply can't beat Sync's pricing. Comparing the unlimited teams plan, we have Dropbox for $24 per month per user, whereas it's $15 for Sync. This difference is huge and the difference will grow with number of employees and we are also getting better features as well. So why not go with the best one? They also have a free plan. Syncs include 5 GB of free, whereas Dropbox only includes 2 GB of storage in their free plan. For me, Sync.com is a better option for teams and businesses. If you are looking for a cloud storage service for collaboration, then you should give it a go. Don't forget to check out the discount links in the description below or visit Sync.com slash the inventor. That's been it for today. Hope you guys found this video helpful. Like, share, subscribe. Stay safe. Bye-bye.